Good morning, everybody. My name is Mitch Eilerman. I'm, I'm with RV Wholesalers. Uh, we're, today, I'm going to give you a walkthrough on a 2020 Puma 32 RBFQ. Uh, what we'll do is we'll go ahead and start at the front. Um, basically, on the front, you've got a full, you got a rock shield, full, uh, nice hard material up front. Uh, you got two propane tanks located located up front with the cover. You'll have a 12 volt deep cycle battery, and then also a, a power tongue jack. Um, as we're moving around. One thing I like is is the you know the way the way everything flows together. Uh, you've got you know everything's more rounded, aerodynamic. So you've got a lot more you know a lot less drag when going down the road. Um, you notice we got RV wholesalers. The, the easiest way to check out our inventory, get a lot of information, is just go to our website, uh, which is www.rvwholesalers.com. Um, and you can also reach out to me anytime. Again, my name is Mitch, and my direct phone number is 937 843 4380. I'd love to go over uh, any questions you have, me and my team, and we'll, we'll, we'll help you guys out with everything. So we'll continue going down some of the uh, features down. Uh, you've got uh, basically, as we Come down you're going to have storage underneath your bed this particular um, model is going to be a pretty unique uh, most of this model you've got a couple options you've got an option to either get um, the front queen bed uh, with a rear bunkhouse or you can get two queen beds so one up front and one in the rear this particular model is going to have two queen beds uh, which a lot of times you're not going to see but it's perfect for couples and you know older you know if, when you have kids and they're they're a little bit older they've got plenty of room they don't have to try to sleep on bunks and everything so that's just your storage location it gives you storage underneath the front bed as we move our way back um, you're going to notice you've got your your port again that's going to be a gray tank um, to to drain your one of your gray tanks as we scoot to the back we'll go through a, f a couple more things here um, this is just another storage location located underneath the dinette which you'll see when we get on the inside but what they're doing is they're just trying to give you a lot of a lot of storage exterior wise wherever they can um, I mentioned up front there was a gray tank this particular model has two gray tanks and gray tanks like shower sink water and everything else and then this is so this is your other location of where where your gray tanks come in and your black tank. Um, you also got your city water connection. That's where you're going to hook up your water to run the water through the unit and then also your power cord location which is detachable so you can take it off and on when you're not using it. Um, also you got more storage here. Um, this is the back bed, uh, queen bed like I was talking to you about. Uh, if we keep moving on our way back, I'm going to come back to you. You got a spare tire on this unit. This is a limited model, uh, which gives you a lot of upgraded features. Um, so I'll go over you know, some of that stuff once we get on the inside. You got backup camera prep, spare tire, uh, location on the back here for your uh, power, your cable, satellite hookups, you just plug in and it's already pre-wired right there for you just to plug right in and run to the inside of the coach. Uh, you've got a rear ladder on this unit. Again, full walk on roof, easy to get, you know, check on top of your slide outs or get any debris that comes off when going through it. Uh, part of the limited package is gives you, uh, you do have power, power jacks. So um, all four corners, you just push the button that runs the jacks up and down so you don't feel like you're on a boat and, and you know, when you're walking through it, so especially with this being a longer uh, unit. Uh, you do have an LP quick connect located right there. And what that does is that pulls off of your front propane tanks. So a lot of people, you know, they're, they're using griddles or they've got their own grill or, or want to bring something with them. Now you don't have to bring a separate tank and do that. All you can do is you get a quick connect, quick connect in that and it'll pull off your front propane tank. So uh, a lot of manufacturers actually don't do that. So just, just another big thing that Puma does. One thing I want to point out that a lot of manufacturers don't too, too is you'll notice on any scene Puma goes through and they put an extra caulking through here just to help for prevent water. Most, most manufacturers you'll look at will never have that caulking in there. So that's just another thing that, um, in my opinion, just steps them up, up above the competition and everything. As we keep going, um, you got two locations here. We got black tank flush. Again, that on the inside of your black tank, your sewer tank, there's a head in there. Uh, you, when you turn on the water, it spins around, keeps the, the, you know, the smell down. It also keeps any type of debris and everything from building up on the inside of the tank. 
Uh, you've got an outside shower here location, so you've got hot and cold water to spray the kids off if they got sand on their feet, uh, the pets and everything else. Um, as we keep going, you'll notice you've got two exterior speakers with the blue light, uh, which looks really sharp, and then you've got a full LED light. Uh, one thing I like about how Puma does their LED lights is it's all in a single track compared to a lot of manufacturers will stick it on the side of the coach and over time that just starts falling off and it, and it doesn't work properly. They put it in a track so it's easier to replace and it won't fail over time and start falling off the side of your unit. Uh, as we keep going, we're gonna come to fresh water and then your uh, water heater. So you've got a fresh water fill location here. Uh, this is your water heater. Uh, your water heater does work off of gas or electric. Uh, you've got an outlet location so you can plug in, you know, if you want to put a little table up here and plug, you know, radio in or, you know, if you're cooking to using a toaster or something like that, you can, you've got plenty, plenty of hookups on the outside as well. Um, and what we'll do now is we'll go on the inside. I'll go over all the features and show you how the floor plan is laid out with both queen beds and everything. Um, as we're coming in here, you're going to run into our Buckeye service guarantee. This is one big thing that we started doing a couple years ago uh, that no other Ohio, de uh, Ohio dealer or anybody else in the country does. And the big things that um, like I tell everybody is, is A, uh, we get free delivery in Ohio. So if you do decide you want to have your unit delivered, you don't want to make the trip back to pick it up and haul it back home and everything, we do do free delivery. Um, second thing we do is if you've got a major warranty issue with your unit that's going to require a lot of shop time, we give you a free rental unit. Um, so you get to use the unit so you don't miss camping trips while your unit's in the shop because that's the one of the biggest problems we we, we talked a lot as a company um, about you know what's what's the biggest complaint in, in service time you know a lot of times it's hard to get parts from the manufacturer so it slows the process up a lot so you know if you're going to be you know a lot of dealerships are six weeks out on service that that may be half your camping season so we said hey what, let's let's have the units for them to use so that they're not missing their trips and everything so just comes back to customer service um, and then the last thing that we do is the three day our three day rv exchange and what that is is once you take possession of your unit you have three days to uh, to bring it back and then to exchange it out for another stock unit that we have um, a lot of people ask why do we do that is last thing i want you to do is take a unit you absolutely hate it and then you're not going to camp anymore so those are a couple big things that we're doing with our buckeye service guarantee and i'd love to go into more detail and answer questions that you have on that as well we'll head on the inside and i'll go over some of the features on the inside here for you uh, again as we're walking up you'll see we've got the solid three steps that touch the ground a lot more solid for you Okay, so we'll start in the living room. Uh, first thing that we'll come to is you've got your uh, jackknife sofa. Um, in the center, you've got a cup holder, which is really nice. You, so you can utilize it as far as, you know, if you've got a couple drinks or something, two people can sit there and relax. Uh, you've got a big U-shaped dinette. Uh, this, this allows a, you know, a bigger family to sit down, but also it gives you a bigger bed to lay down too, because that'll go down into a bed. Um, they do the nicer, nicer fixtures in here, a little bit lighter, lighter color wood, so it brightens it up a lot. This is the ice latte uh, furniture color, which is more like a gray microfiber material. Um, as you'll notice, we've got, we've got a uh, more storage, you know, right here, part of the pantry back here. Um, one, one thing that Puma does is they've got a huge fridge. So this is a residential fridge that works off a 12 volt. Um, so you can still run it going down the road off a of 12 volt. You don't, you know, a lot of people get concerned because with the gas, you can run the gas, but the, when, when you're running the gas down the road, that's not necessarily safe all the time. This is safe and this will last you for a long period of time too. Uh, I'll open it up a little bit just so you can see how much bigger it is. Uh, this is a 10.7 10 cubic foot refrigerator. Uh, most of your um, gas and electric refrigerators are going to be six. So it's almost double. Uh, they do a nice stainless steel front stainless steel on the microwave, stainless steel on the oven, and then you've got a glass top that sits flush with the counter, gives you more counter space, and then you just flip that twice, you've got three burners there. Um, one, one thing they do too, you'll notice that 
they do on their countertops, they roll that all. That's all one piece here, so it rolls over. So a lot of the older units that you'll see, sometimes when we get like a used unit in, it's got a seam that comes around here. Well, over time, especially on these corners, these seams start pulling apart, and, and you know it, the countertop just starts pulling apart and starts warping. With this being all the way curved over, you'll never have that issue. Um, they got it's a pretty cool little drying rack thing that they do here and they basically this just rolls up and there's two of them and allows you to you know put plates or stack stuff on here and, and and allow them to dry when you're doing dishes they do a stainless steel sink which is all undermounted um, they do have a nicer you know faucet nicer handle it's actually you know something like your like your house not not the cheaper plastic stuff um, as we'll turn around and we'll look right here this is your entertainment center um so you've already got uh your wireless where you can bluetooth and hook up to your surround sound system here um they do back this wall um so you, you could mount your tv they've already got an hdmi or yeah your hdmi cord pre-ran so that you can plug in and run everything through through the tv through the speakers down here um, and it saves you a ton of money by getting your own TV. You can get a lot better brand and, uh, and a lot better quality um, and still mount it in here versus being forced to buy a TV for a lot more money from the manufacturer that's off brand. So that's why we do that a lot of times. Uh, we'll keep moving up to the front here. The first, this will be the first spot we come to. So this is the first bedroom. So this has got two queen beds on each end. Um, this is your front bedroom. This particular unit has uh, the limited package with the upgraded limited package with two air conditioners. So you've got an air conditioner here, and then you've got a main one that's centrally located. And that main one is going to be a 15,000 BTU air conditioner that's ducted throughout. And then this particular one will, will, will dump just right in your main bedroom. Um, you'll notice you've got a ton of storage up front here. Uh, so this is all hanging. This has been one of our top sellers probably for about the last three years once it's came out. Um, for A, the amount, the, the separate bedroom with the bed slide, it gives you a ton of bedroom space. Um, but the next thing I want to show you is one of the biggest reasons as well, is you've got a full washer and dryer closet. It's already pre-ran uh, with washer and, with water, hot water and cold water. Uh, it's got your outlets for your dryer, dryer and your washer to plug into and you can do a full stackable unit in this. Um, there's not very many RV manufacturers that give you this option out there, especially if you're going to be staying in the unit for long periods of time. Um, you know, like a lot of people do here in Ohio, they love to go down to Florida, get out of the cold weather for, you know, four or five months. Now they've got a, basically a full-time uh, unit so that they can stay in for a few months. So um, you've got you know more storage here. You've got storage underneath the bed, which goes to that pass-through storage on the outside that we had looked at earlier. Uh, you can mount a TV in here. You've got a location where they back the spot again, and then you can plug right in. Uh, they use these, it's called the King uh, antenna. And basically all you do is you just turn this, you push this and you turn this to find your signal. Um, on the older units, you used to have to crank that up to, and then turn it to find your signal. Now you just turn this, you don't have to worry about um, cranking it back down and before you leave and you know forgetting it and hitting it on something. So they do do two USB ports here as well. So if you wanna plug your phones in at night and stuff, you can plug right in, set it on your countertop. Uh, let's move our way to the back. We've already went through the living room. I'll hit the bathroom on the way, and then we'll go back to the, uh, the rear bedroom. Okay, so bathroom-wise, you've got a full glass shower, okay? You've got your toilet, you've got a medicine cabinet, uh, your sink, and then you've got more storage underneath as well. Nice size bathroom um, compared to a lot of them. That you'll run into moving to the back again i did i re mentioned this briefly this model has the uh the other queen bed so you can also get this particular floor plan with bunks where there would be bunks here an entertainment center uh, with a top bunk 
and then this and then if you go with the bunk option you can get an outside kitchen on the exterior where when you're going with the queen bed option the way that this comes in so far you can't get that outside kitchen because there's not enough room um, but again now you got if you got two couple older couples or you know even older children that don't fit in the bunks anymore uh, now you've got plenty of space for everybody there and you when you're going with the queen bed option you've got a ton more storage up front here too as you can notice you got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten look ten drawers that you can open up and utilize and you've got a tv backer to get everything set up as well um, so it just gives you a ton more space and everything there uh, what we'll do is we'll go in the living room um, i want to go over uh, one thing real quick with everybody you know we went over our buckeye service guarantee another thing and that you know that goes for like our ohio customers now out-of-state customers because we sell a ton of business out of state uh, big thing we do is we have nationwide service and warranty and what that is is you know when you're traveling and you, if you ever got a problem with your unit all you do is we've got a full-time staff that's all they do all year long um, you call in you ask for out-of-state customer service and they'll help you with everything they'll tell you you know where to go uh, we've got our network set up over the, the whole United States and all throughout Canada. So if you've got an issue, we, we just we set up the appointment for you. Uh, we've got a thing called RVW Bill Pay. And what that is is we, we pay for the approved warranty claim out of our pocket and get reimbursed from the factory compared to you having to show out the money and then fight with the factory to get reimbursed and not have you know extra money for your camping trips and everything else. Um, another big thing I like about it is is you know, uh, especially out of state customers ask about, you know, you know, service and warranty, getting the unit taken care of. They think, you know, if I buy locally, I can get it worked on easier. Well, the biggest thing that a lot of people don't think about is, is what happens when you travel. And that's usually why you're buying these is you're going to take trips. Well, you can't just turn around in the middle of a trip, go home. I just had a customer last week that actually had taken his family down to Disneyland. And when they got down there, their, their water heater was bad. We, he called up, he called me up, and I got him over to our customer service department, and then they, they got everything set up, and they were able to get his water heater taken care of right there at Disney so that his trip wasn't, wor wasn't ruined now. Um, that's one big thing that you, you really, until you have an issue, you don't realize the importance of it. So I want to just explain how that part of it works um, with being out of state or even in state. So um, I'd love, love to help anybody out. Uh, this is a great model. I've got it with the two queen beds with the bunk beds if you prefer it that way. Um, feel free to give me a call. Again, my direct phone number is 937-843-4380. Um, I work on a team, um, either myself, uh, Cass, Matthew, um, and, and Jamie, and, and then also Julia. We can all help you out and, and take care of everything as far as that goes and um, answer your questions and help you get into one. Um, I look forward to helping everybody out. Um, again, our website is www.rvwholesalers.com. Uh, please check us out. We'd love to help you. Thank you.